His new album, Time Stood Still, breaks a number of Gosden traditions. He'll be using a fiddle on one cut and do some honky-tonk on another. Oh, while we're talking about tradition, here's Greg Crutcher with a profile of medicine show Tommy Scott. He's a veteran performer who's keeping a part of American musical history alive. Back in town. Oh, Tommy Scott is the last of the old-time medicine men. Since 1936, he's traveled the back roads of America and Canada, playing an incredible 350 dates a year, breathing new life into a century-old entertainment tradition. Back at the turn of the century in the late 1800s, the only entertainment the small towns got was when the old-timey medicine show come to town once a year. They used to come into town and put on a free show, and then they would sell a bottle of medicine and all the hokum that went along with it. And uh, it, the medicine show's performance was a banjo picker, guitar player, a magician, a monkey on a chain, and this type of thing. Anything that the old docs could create attention with to get the crowd so he could pitch them a bottle of snake oil or hokum, and that would gather the crowd and then hold their attention and give them the entertainment. Then he'd jump on them and give them the pitch and sell. Try a bottle of this stuff today. Just take it as it's plainly directed. It'll drive your wheels away. Little small dose taken in the morning and another noon at night. Why you'll feel so well, you'll want to yell. Oh, the stuff will make you right. The medicine Scott sells is plainly labeled snake oil. But surely there's no snake in it. <laughs> no, it don't have any snake in it, or it never has had. Now, the reason for the snake, the old doc, when he... Uh, started to try to think up a name for the stuff, he said. He got to thinking, he says, well, fire and a snake creates attention more than anything else. So he got the idea to put the snake on. But there's never been any snake in the modern snake oil that I say. Scott says many of the fine voices of country music started out in medicine shows. Indeed, they play a vital role in the evolution of country music. Absolutely. Ray Acuff started out on a medicine show. And, uh, well, the Duke of Paducah was on a medicine show. Hank Williams was on a medicine show. Did you know that? Yeah, Hank was on a medicine show. Red Skelton was on a medicine show. Take a dose or two of the cure-all and your trouble got to go. And tell them you got it at the medicine show. Jake will, he bottled your all. Tell them it's a little bit of mine. Jake will, he bottled your all. That's still a thing. Jake will, I'm thinking a whole bottle of it. If ever there was a showman, it's Tommy Scott, last of the medicine men and a medicine man to the last. So